Hello guys, I'm back with more Walking Dead. Yes, you heard it, part 3. And I'm not gonna stop until I do all the episodes. And this is episode 1, part 3, and uh, this is gonna be fun, guys. So, uh, last time this happened, I, uh, well, I went into Clementine's house because I need, I don't know, I needed help. I cut myself. I'm emo. I'm so emo. And right now, I, whoa, what the hell? Right now we are probably going this way because I saw the last time I ended this episode here. I mean that episode. So, uh, let's just, uh, whoa, God. Uh, uh, oh man. I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. Okay, I guess we're gonna help them or talk to Clementine. Cutie pie. You're so cute. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Um... <laughs> they won't. <laughs> uh, you won't leave? I won't leave you. Though. Oh, no. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. I agree. No, I don't. Let's just... Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Um... What's going on? Do you know what the hell this is? No idea. So you've seen them then? You could say that. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. You shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Uh... A neighbor. A neighbor. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? Hi. The monster's coming. We gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. Oh no! I gotta help. Come on. Come on, do it. Uh, oh, come on, you fucking Clementine. She's so strong. More? No. Clementine, she's so strong. What are those guys? Neighbors too? No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual this past couple days. Well, Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you, then. You've brought a couple guests. Mm. Your boy your is a lifesaver. Life Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He was her neighbor. Honey, do you know this man? Yeah. 
Yes. <laughs> okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. What if she said no? Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. Might can help it would have killed me. Come on, run on in and check on your sister. God damn it. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Yeah. Can I skip this? This is this to hell. A fucking hour. Uh, could be worse. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? I didn't. I didn't. Well, now's the time. It's Lee. It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? I don't remember. I don't even remember. It's crazy back there in the city. Hmm. It must be. What type of danger has the girl seen? She's safe now. She's safe now. You're serious about taking care of her then? What choice is there? House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there, and we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we got to reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son is right! Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Mm. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. <laughs> Look at Clementine. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barns. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. All right, then. It smells, it smells like... <laughs> um... Manure. Manure. Manure? Like, like when a horse plops? <laughs> plops? When a horse plops? That's I all. Miss, I miss my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Okay. Hey, get up. I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. But I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the fence. There's a tractor and everything. Fucking retard. We better get going. Or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Uh, dodging and quacking. Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad, 
See? See? The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Sure, we'll tag along. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Okay, I'm gonna end this episode here and I gotta do it really fast. So thank you guys for watching this epic video and um, comment, like, and favorite if you enjoyed this video. And please subscribe. I'll be right back. Goodbye.